on today's episode of Bacon Family Adventures. You excited? Yeah. Woo! We're going to Kings Island, so come along with us and enjoy the ride. Well, we are ready for a super fun day at Kings Island. It's currently about 9.30 or so. We typically get there right when it opens. And Allison, my amazing camera person, is helping me out today. Yep. So, gosh, it is such a beautiful day. Unfortunately, John couldn't come with us. He had to work that morning. So, Allison and I made it a really fun day, just the two of us. Yep. All right, how are you feeling? Good. You excited? Yeah. Woo! All right, now the first thing we're going for is what? The racers. The racers. It's one of Allison's favorite rides at the moment. She tried it sometime last year and completely fell in love with it. It's kind of at the other end of the park. Now, here's a preview of what we're going to be doing later on. The Phantom Theater Show based on an old ride that used to be at Kings Island. So now we made it to the racers mm -hmm. and there's like nobody there. It's amazing. Yep. Yeah. I'm so excited because I absolutely love this ride. Oh my gosh, we just rode the racers twice in a row. Yeah. Now, the thing about Kings Island, they open at 10, but they also have early ride times starting at 9.30. And the rides just depend on what time of the year it is. So this, this month, it was the racers and Orion, Woodstock Express. And so we got on the racers because if you try to get on it later in the day, it's like anywhere between 30 and 60 minutes and both times we walked onto it and <laughs> it's crazy so poor allison like she's so small that the lap bar couldn't go down all the way so she found herself like jumping up or flying up in her seat every time they went down a hill yeah so like here's my like here's my legs here's the lap bar yes yeah, it was insane, but now we're just waiting for everything else to open up at 10. Um, we're standing outside, or sitting outside Adventure Express, one of her favorite coasters of all time. Pretty mild, but it'll open at 10 and we'll get to riding everything else. Yep. Now we're heading over to the kid area because we're going to ride Boo Blasters on Boo Hill, which is an indoor ride and that's actually where the haunted house used to be. So, so, yeah. Here's some footage of the Viking Fury, a big Viking ship. She and likes that. There's the entrance. Yes, it's hard to take video. You can't really take video on the rides, but it was a lot of fun. Now it's lunchtime, so I went to Hank's, which is basically like Chipotle. Got myself a burrito bowl, and then Allison got her favorite meal, which is pizza! Pizza and breadsticks. We get that for lunch basically every single time. Now, the one cool thing I was looking forward to seeing was this new like garden area. They've had it for a while, but they recently transformed it into like a blast from the past. So they have a bunch of little stepping stones with the like the timeline of like when Kings Island opened and each year like what cool new things came out. They also created miniature replicas of the Eiffel Tower based on the main roller coasters. So you can see the colors are amazing and it's just really cool to see all the cool little things they did for each ride. Yep. So I'm doing the footage here. I'm mommy's camera girl. So. Yep. She did a great job. So Allison, what was your favorite Eiffel Tower out of all of them? Probably either the one for Orion or the one for the racers. Oh, those are all good. I I like the bat. There's something about the color scheme and seeing all the bats on there. It was super cool. Yeah.
Next up, we're gonna go see the Phantom Theater Encore Show. Now, like I said, this was based on a haunted house ride that was here for, I think it said like 11 years or something like that. It was in where Boo Blasters is now and you sit in that little car that you see right here and it just takes you throughout like a little haunted house area. I was super sad to see it go, but I was really excited to see like what this show would be about. We weren't allowed to take video or pictures or anything during the show, but it was basically like a musical with a little bit of acrobatics in it and right outside the theater here they showed some old props so little pictures and statues and things and they also had a miniature replica of what the haunted house looked like so it like takes you through the entire little house here and gosh just looking at it made me realize how much I missed it now Allison she was not here um, when the haunted house was around so she unfortunately got to miss out on the entire thing but what did you think of the show i really liked it it's got a lot of quirky ideas it's funny it's got a little bit of spookiness but not all that much mm -hmm. it's really cool yeah and before the show started we got a special guest John Kane! He had to work today, but he met us uh, just in time for the show, actually. So, um, had my Starbucks, and we're probably going to go try to ride some more rides. Did we agree on the racer? No. No? Okay. Maybe something different. We'll have to go see. starting to sprinkle so you are hiding in there yes it's my own little house <laughs> all right this, this is the best time to go to king's island when it's the threat of rain because nobody's here so their line for Orion was only like 15 minutes and typically it is about an hour wait so of course I had to get in line. Um, it is about, it's kind of sprinkling at this point so that's why all the lines are not very long. It is seriously the best time to go and this ride came out in like 2020 and so far I mean it has surpassed all my expectations. Now it's time for dinner. So Allison got Subway, but we went to the Coney Island Barbecue, which is like a smokehouse. You can get pulled pork and sausages and things. So I got pulled pork with macaroni and cheese. And gosh, that is so much food. It is one of my favorite places to go. I mean, they also have like vegetable side items too. So it's a good place to eat slightly healthier if you choose to eat that way. But oh my gosh, it has been a long day. We didn't plan on staying this long, um, but then John came and so we decided to stay for dinner and now it's time to go home. Oh my gosh, we are exhausted. Like we got there at nine o'clock, almost nine o'clock or a little after, and we got home a little after six o'clock. So Allison is showered. She is very, very tired. But did you have fun today at least? Yeah. What was your favorite part? Um, probably the racers. The racers, yeah. Riding that twice in a row. <laughs> and then we did Adventure Express. And then my, I think my favorite part was getting to ride Orion. It was only like 20 minutes and it was amazing. So all in all, I think we had a good day. What do you think, Allie? Yeah. All right, today was pretty awesome. Bye.